Check it out, listen up, let me tell you something real cool about a YouTube channel that's gonna make you drool. Psych it up is the name. And it's time to get it started. We're gonna shake things up, leave you broken hearted. With funny skits and pranks and comedy galore. Check it out, it's gonna keep you coming back for more. Got the rhythm on repeat Subscribe, don't you miss the beat Join the party, we're taking it to the streets We'll break it down, making you move Check it, it's got that electronic groove Hit that like button, don't be shy We're gonna light up the sky, oh my Check it out, subscribe and turn it up we're gonna party till the sun comes up Get your groove on It's time to play Together we'll make every day a holiday empty what happened to me where am I what is going on why am I here welcome back sir. so by interstellar this is real life made to measure Oh, I can get a hat. I want the hat, though. I like my hat. Okay. Yeah, I'd like more ammo capacity. Who wouldn't? Any of these? Hmm. 
I'd rather have the extra ammo. Is this all gun belts? being an herbalist make my gun belt better. Okay, I need a perfect alligator skin. That's what I need. What did I do? I think I rode all the way here. I thought it was over there. I don't know. Gotta get a perfect alligator skin though. Do I care about that? No. No, I don't. Not even a little. Okay, why can't I call my horse? There we go. Okay, let's go blindly down the mountain. Hope we don't trip over anything. Guess if these guys can run somewhere, my horse can too. Oh, we gotta go this way now. again. So like how my view count in the studio is jumping between like three and zero and then five and zero and seven and zero. YouTube's having a good day. We're gonna have a good day too. Yeah. No we're not. I have to mow the lawn after this. is changing. Changes to reflect when it drops to zero and then it pretends that didn't happen. Back to zero. Maybe stop trying to kill me while I'm out minding my own business. That'd be cool. 
I don't even know who these people are. I just know they want me dead. I don't know what I did. I don't think I did anything. I played this game like a absolute saint. Never done a bad thing, even when the game wanted me to. My horse is tired now. Okay, what? Please leave me alone, gentlemen. I'm just out for a leisurely ride with my 50 guns. Is there just a dead horse in the road? What kind of place is this? Okay, they're teaching some dude to read over there? It's an upside out M. I don't get it. I don't get it either. What even is a letter? What did that subtitle say? Oh, what did I do? No fans. None taken. None taken at all. Hey, stop! These kids that are worse. Don't hurt him, please. I want to hurt him. I punch this kid in the head seven times. Go, don't steal from the church. You all right? Oh, I'll live. Kid did this? Uh, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? Uh, that way. Please. Thank you. He robbed me. He robbed a nun. Where's my watch, you little weasel? Which is like worse. Hey, you. Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. I promise you that. Alright, forget it. Little shit ain't even worth my time. Alright, hit him. Nope, hit him. Oh, he dropped it. Can I hit him anyway? I'd like to hit him. Hey, you want some company, mister? No. You sure? 
Hey, I know you. This is Bounce. Oh, no. Not you. Get away. How? Now. I mean, I, hey, help. Uh, help. Hold on. This man is bothering me. Now. Someone help me. Officer, help. Escape the law. For I didn't do anything. It's a French town. It makes sense that they would just take the word of a prostitute. Okay, I just trampled a man. Of course, a town run by French people is going to take the word of a prostitute. Just no evidence. Just this man's bothering me. Oh, sir, that's a crime. Don't bother women. Not in our town. We're French. Only we're allowed to bother the women without alerting the law. Does that does it sound like that's going to happen? The, the law is going to be alerted. 100%. They're going to be alerted. What you got all worked up for? Well, I don't know, the cops. They're like trying to kill me. Look, man, sorry, my horse is it's got a learning disability. I'm gonna hide my horse here. That's a new challenge, father. When I was young. Mr. Morgan! Hey, excuse me, father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't! Oh, I did. Oh, I hope the boy He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother Dorkins was right about you. You are the most wonderful man. I trampled a man on a horse before coming here. Greatly deceived, I'm afraid, but I'm happy to help a little. Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but my mother gave it to me when I was a novice, shortly before she passed. She's a journeyman nun. The most wonderful man. She leveled up. Excuse me, father. Sister, enjoy your day. See, Father? Don't go that way. There's a Mr. cop right there. Oh. I told you. Oh, the cops don't care anymore, I guess. Got, uh, yeah, I'm fine. Okay, wasn't there another mission here? Yeah, right there. I agree. Well, I know why I did that. Because barbarity is boring, you no? Know? You kept me amused some years. You must go, my friend, before the gendarmerie arrive. Hey, you gonna do right by this fella's wife? You have done right by her. The little bird is free. Mm. I am an artist, cowboy. I must do what I feel. Look, I have an exhibit at the gallery. You come, see what I mean. Yeah, let me go to an art gallery. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'll get right on that. Morning, mister. Who's talking? The word is excuse me. Ooh, a dog. You okay, boy? Let me pet this filthy dog. 
Why would it let me pet the dog? It's because the dog is filthy. This dog has mange. My horse is like, what is that thing? that that's a photo studio oh, it's back to zero cool 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 that's accurate that might be accurate Are you yep I bring my, uh. okay my horse didn't like the stairs Watch my horse. Are you well? Nope. Fell off a horse. You know what? I'm feeling good today. Feeling good today. Just hit my head really hard on the concrete. No, I can't be anything but happy. Yes, here I am. Well, we're going to need to get you smartened up a bit. Excuse me? Well, you can't play at the tables on a Lanahassee riverboat looking like this. Can't? Not if you want to fit in so well no one realizes you're there to rob the place. Now, come on. What are you talking about? But I am there to that rob the place. Is not fit for the purpose at hand. Come along, dear boy. Come along. I like my suit. Hello. Can I help you, gentlemen? Yes. My friend here is in need of a new suit. We are playing on the riverboat this evening. Make this gentleman look like the duke he really is. Playing on the riverboat this evening, and my friend is dressed like a lunatic. Alright, yeah, I, I look a lot better now. You can see the aristocrat in his profile. Come on, let's get see the homeless on. addict in the way that he carries himself. Herr Strauss has scoped the whole thing out. It's quite ingenious, actually. What Should I get a top hat? The action he has planned. Indeed, it's not much of an action at all. You play cards and you should have gotten a top hat. You're going to bet very big and flamboyantly while you win. And everyone's going mm. to think you're some new money from the oil fields come to lay it on thick and drunk. All the while, Herr Strauss will be signaling you in your line of sight. When you bust the place, they'll take you upstairs to pay you off. That okay, that's good. I thought I was going to have to win on my own. You, take whatever you, want. you don't think they might see an armed Mexican coming into the safe with me? Sure, they might, but perhaps not. You will see. The suspense is killing me. Oh, don't be so jaded. We both know this is just the kind of innocent fun you thrive on. Well, well after the past couple of months... Arm robbery don't seem such an innocent pastime. No, but we, you, all of us, will be done here soon. I hope so. Come on. Oops, then I won't have to be around the French any longer. My good man, could you smarten up my dear hick friend here? Excuse me? I've cultivated this look. Likely fellow has made himself a fortune in the oil fields and learned himself not a lick of manners or gentlemanly deportment. Well, very good, sir. No, it's not good. Not good at all. Not if they're going to let him play big at the tables tonight. No. No, 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 we're not trimming this. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nope, we are done here. There, very smart. Come on. I look smart as hell. 
Look at me, smart guy, bumping into stuff. Tally ho, top hat. I really feel like I should have gotten a top hat. Shuffle and mumble. Saint Ham. So, who's a mark? Are you alright, by the way, the driver? Oh, yes. Don't worry. George and I go way back. It's a man called Desmond Bly. Made a fortune in hosiery of all things. <laughs> Likes to play fast and always keep some extra collateral in the safe upstairs. So if Strauss is sitting behind him, how does he know what cards I got? He won't. But the dealer has recently become a very good friend of mine. Another one. Don't worry, Arthur. We're all the authors of our own good fortune. He'll make sure you get the right cards. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Indeed. And what money am I playing with? Don't worry, that has all been arranged. Your chips will be waiting for you. Ah, there she is. Come on. Okay. Arthur, leave any weapon be here. We'll search us when we get on. George, we'll collect these from you later. What's up, Carl? Sir. Thank you, George. Good luck, sir. I'm not bringing my guns. Now remember what I said, Arthur. Everyone is the author of his own Oh, hi, Mr. Zippy. Yes, yes, believe me, yeah. I heard every word. Kind of busy. Strauss, listen to the dealer, and this should be a very lucky night. There they are. Gentlemen, how wonderful to see you. Arthur, you remember this pair of boys we met in New York? Come on. Champagne Guess I'm playing through Streamlabs right now. He's rich as can be and feeling luckier than a turkey that survived Thanksgiving. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, dear boy. Hello. Come on, come on, let's head aboard. Drinks on Arthur. Champagne. I'm afraid we require all patrons to hand over their guns. Good time. The tables await. I didn't hit anything. Myself to change clothes. Okay. You seem unsure. Robbing a heavily armed riverboat without a gun tends to bring out the self-doubt in me. These people are virtually idiots. This is simple stuff. Now I'm have a here. good time, but don't lose too much money, or your wife is going to kill me. Whatever you say. I'll lose a lot of money. Uh, I opened the facial hair menu and then just exited it. So if they were gonna make me, uh, have Arthur Morgan cut his glorious beard, I was just gonna not do the mission. Good evening, gentlemen. Arthur Callahan. Sorry I'm late. I had some, uh, unfinished business at the bar. Hey, Desmond Clive. Good evening. Not to worry. Welcome to the game, Mr. Callahan. Okay, this gentlemen. cat. Let's play. Hope you're this play. cat. Been too many cowards at these tables recently. Nothing less dignified than a man afraid to lose a little money. Look at He's this. actually looking at the camera. All right, cool. Uh, I like this joint already. Yeah, Mr. Zippy, I'm trying to gamble. So, can you? How are we all fair? Uh, let's see what uh raise. Trying to look around a cat. All right, what's happening? Uh, take my turn. Uh, okay, we're gonna raise twenty dollars. I don't know what's happening. Good God, are you men or mice? 
Hmm, my cards. Yeah, yep, there's a cat in the way. Can't see my cards. Uh, did I win? Okay, sorry, boys. I'm taking it all. Yep, looks like I won. Okay. Um, what am I doing? Okay, that man behind him is supposed to be signaling me. Um. Are you playing? He's okay. He's gonna take a sip of his drink. Uh, so I'll call. What the hell? Yeah, why not? Why not? Uh, Mr. Zippy, you gotta like go. Okay, so I won. Mr. Blythe wins with three queens. Am I Mr. Blythe? I'm not Mr. Blythe today. Goodbye, gentlemen. I guess it's just you and me now, friend. Yes, it is. Time to see if you're really the man you okay. seem to think you are. All right, Mr. Zippy, Likewise, you need to go. Or at least not lay right in front of the screen. We gotta get serious about whatever is happening here. I'm an oil man. I'm, a sense. I'm an oil man. I haven't heard of you. I'm an oil man and a swamp man. Uh, let's see, what is he telling me to do? Uh, he nodded, so we're gonna. Uh, $20? Oh, it's. Yep, we're gonna raise 100. Did I win? I won. What does he think I should do? Ah, uh, yes. Uh, all in. Interesting. Pair of cowgirls. I don't know what those cards are about. Um, I won, I guess. Shit. Shit. I guess my mm. luck held. Is that you done? Done. Bust. All right. Uh, you got something else to play with. Meaning. I heard. Very good at. Well, oh yeah, I love cards of some kind. You. No offense, sit your hillbilly ass down. Ooh. Why? I got a watch. My name is not even Billy. An expensive one. Ooh. Real fine. Swiss. A Reutlinger, no less. It's in the safe upstairs. It's worth more than you. Ooh. Okay. I trust you. Now play as you wish. So you must know Leviticus Cornwall, big oil man like you. Of course, we've crossed paths. I was fortunate enough to tour a little operation. Yeah, everyone knows hand. Leviticus Cornwall. Okay, uh, what are my cards? My cards, uh, two no kings. Worries. I think that's Never probably good. Of his own good fortune. It's probably good. Ah, uh, yeah, we're gonna go all in. Probably good to have two kings. Very good, but not good enough. What does that mean? Pair of eight. Why did that other guy nod at me? Uh oh. Yes, you little beauty. Hard lines, Mr. Blythe. Mr. Callahan wins with an ace high diamond flush. What? God damn you! No offense. None take. Well played, sir. On your lucky Desmond. Now, forgive my lack of discretion, but uh, where might I find this watch? It's upstairs. Shall we go and have a look? Why not? Let me bring my heavily armed Mexican that we talked Please about earlier. These out for me. I, I started last week. Good. Sure. How come these two get to have guns? Yes, of course, sir. Hi. Follow okay, me, looks gentlemen. like I won some kind of gambling challenge. You're having quite the night. Yeah, so far. Yep, I've been cheating at cards. I cannot believe someone gave a greaser a job. <laughs> we live in strange times. What does that mean? This is not the 1950s. I wouldn't trust one with a gun, but fear not. I've got my own little law giver right here. Very good. I like this guy walking around on the fancy ship, just waving his gun around. Next, we'll be hiring Negroes. Hell yeah. I know. I, know. I think you 
you're going to like this watch, sir. I saw it earlier, and it really is a handsome piece. Foreign made, but you can't have everything. Indeed. Well, here we are. I do remember that. Just give me one second, sir. Of course, take your time. I played that mission twice, actually, because the game crashed the one time I played it. Don't reach for that gun. Take his gun, Arthur. Uh, I, I thought it was pretty funny, and I was like, I don't think you're supposed to say that. I don't think you could say that on YouTube. Only an idiot would give a greaser a gun. <laughs> idiot, huh? Wow, two guns, idiot. Uh, let's hope no one heard a gunshot on a boat. I bet the rest of this mission is going to go very smoothly. Let's maybe walk faster. Nope. There was no gunshot where we're coming from. How exactly are we getting out of here? I ain't too sure. We're gonna swim. This is what tends to happen when you leave Trelawney in charge of planning. Oh garnish no meat. Ah, that's where you got that from, Carl. Dressing up as dancing girls. Can cannon off the side. Nice uniform, by the way. Thanks. You give anyone a job these days. Anyway, we shouldn't give ourselves away until we know we need to. Maybe we could still blend into the crowd when it all goes crazy. Which it surely will. To the bar, senor! I hope you had fun, sir. <laughs> In the time of my life. You boys sure know how to put on a show. <laughs> That's wonderful. Ah, <laughs> look, there's your friend. Now, oh, don't be a sore loser, friends. Something I don't like about the pair of you. There's plenty I don't like about you, but I have the good manners to keep my mouth shut. There he is! Shoot that man! What? Come on, Arthur. Is that all you have to do on a boat? See how there he is? Shoot that man? don't have all my my little treats with me that gunshot kill that man what's that why think I get back up Let's leave. What? Are you shooting? Uh, there's someone up there. Oh, there's someone. Oh. Are you coming? Let's go. Sorry, there's a guy shooting at me. Oh. I'm shooting people. Is that what you guys like for me to do? Yeah, the money's gonna get wet. Guns are gonna get wet. Also, I'm wearing a suit. Yeah, but evidently the plan was to swim away. Well, never a dull moment. Yeah, that's one way of putting it. So, how much did we get? A few thousand, I think. We got six dollars and a Casio yes, watch. Indeed. And this watch. Uh, apparently it's worth a bunch of uh, Swiss, uh, a Reutlinger or something. Nice watch. Nice watch, but now it's yes, full of water. It's a Reutlinger, all right. <laughs> we'll give it back then. All right, come on, 
Let's get out of here. This relatively straightforward boat robbery. That hotel sign was bigger than the new Detroit sign. I have unopened mail or parcels. Let's go to the post office. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. Carl, it's a bomb. What's wrong with you? I got mail. I got mail. I got mail. Hi. I see your friend. I hope you out press. Oh, I have a bounty. Be a lot easier for you once you're all square. Evidently. Uh, I got mail. Ooh, the mayor. Wow. Oh, those are words, all right. Farewell. Farewell. Okay. Where do I go? What's this? It's going on up here. Oh. Oh, the Wagon of Moonshine. Yes. Let's go get our hundred gallons of moonshine. What is the point of this? Look out! What's in your bra? Oh. Oopsie. Unarmed as what? It's illegal to hit someone with your horse. You just bump them a little bit and they fall down. Maybe you would consider borderline drinkable cleaning what? I'm like forty five percent's pretty standard. These people think I committed a crime. A town full of French people. Yeah, this is going to get me a good gator skin. Four arrows sticking out of it. What? Okay. Skin the gator. Poor. Poor alligator skin. I used arrows. Not 
another gator out there? Let me, let me try something else. Shoot towards the train. No. Now, what do you want? All right, man. All right. Doctor. You're gonna be okay. No. You're gonna help me. Oh. You gotta. Oh. You gotta. Yeah. Yeah, I'll help. This one good at least? Ooh, this one is good. The question is, can I carry two of them? Oh, my horse can't carry two. Alright. Uh, so we're going to take that one. Because it's of poor quality. And uh, we're going to dump it in the swamp. I think that man is still in trouble over there. I should help him. I think that man might have been dead. my horse. Uh, let me get the right weapons. Gentlemen, Horse get confused? Uh oh. Uh oh. No, oh, it's still coming. Don't yell at my horse.
Jack! You're a wonderful man! Wonderful! <laughs> you got my money? It's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell III. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. Oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. <laughs> uh, I don't read much. Oh, oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money? <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great All deal. All I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers, excellent the nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable, a way to induce calmness to our most troubled souls, a way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. What are you talking about? The electric chair. What? It's a chair full of electricity. Quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Where is it? Well, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration. A public one. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful. Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? Notice at no point in that did he give me money. I killed four people. This one. That's closer. Oh, this wonderful methanol. Take a look at it. Pleasure doing business with you. It's all kind, right? Thanks, Mister. the message last time well I'll be keeping an eye on you that's for sure what can I do for you <sighs> see I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine an electric chair and he uh, wants to demonstrate his invention here ah I'm familiar with the man and his work tell you what I'll give you a permit but it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Okay. Well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen in the usual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatch. Yeah, who cares? I'll tell that to the professor. Like three and a half grand.
I've been spending my money on stupidity like making my gun gold. Hello, Professor... Professor... Andrew Bell the Third. That's it. So, the Chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable, uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels, wanted for murder, bigamy, and immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. Ugh. Here, find him for me and help me put him out of his misery. Huh. To find someone and not kill them. Is he in the swamp? He's probably in the swamp. He's not in the swamp. Is that him? No, I don't want to talk to her. There he is. I have to not kill him. Hey. The hell's wrong with you? Yeah. What if he gets struck by lightning? It's like an electric chair.
Have I what? Donated. He has some stuff. Does it want me to turn? Why is it sending me back? Oh, okay. It wants me to go off through the woods here. Couldn't just walk up that. I can't brush the horse or anything. Is it because I'm on a hill? Apparently can't brush it on a hill. brush the horse while on the horse. Okay, the horse does not like being on this hill. Alright, let me go find this guy and then hope the horse can come find me. So I'm not carrying this dude. I left all my guns. Oh wait, no, I'm not not supposed to kill him. That's probably better. Do I have my lasso? I do. Okay. It went so much more smoothly than I thought it was going to. This is very kind of you. All right.
hope the horse can... Okay, good. Hit him. Sounds like sour grapes. You know, you ain't going to court. You ain't going to jail either. I'm taking you to a professor I know. What the hell are you talking about? You're a lucky man, mister. You get to be part of a great experiment. Shut up. Uh, you ain't going to die needlessly, is what I mean. Nope. If that's going to be in. Uh, of human knowledge. What the hell are you saying, mister? This professor, Andrew Bell III, I believe he said. He's a little odd, maybe harebrained, but I got no reason to doubt the quality of his work. What's this damn professor got to do with anything? Well, he wants to try this new electricity chair on you to kill you. You mean? gonna strap you into this contraption and run a large electric current through your system. It's got something to do with moonshine. I don't quite know what. I guess that's why he's a professor and I'm the bounty catcher. Well, as I said, I can pass on his assurances that this is a most humane way to go. It'll be just like... Oh, my hat well, fell off. Like switching off a light. <laughs> they wouldn't let you do this to me. Where's my hat? There's my hat. Oh, they would. And we got a permit and everything. You would say an animal husbandry, am I right? Well, you ever seen lightning strike livestock, Mr. McDaniel? No, I ain't ever seen the actual impact. But I came across a pasture sometime after. The storm had just cleared and there was smoke in the air. The smell of burning hair. You know, there must have been a dozen head of cattle. Lying there, piled up, mangled, strange scars across their backs, legs, and necks. It's half like they was burned, half like the skin was ripped off. No! Eyes bleeding, some of them popped out. No! Imagine being kidnapped by this guy and he just casually shoots three people. Now, 
It happens. Come on. Ah, let me get a look at him, please. Okay. Now where's my money? Um money? Yeah, for all the running around I've been doing. Oh, well. Once they buy my humane Where, electric, uh, why am I untying this guy? Uh, there'll be money enough for you, sir. Uh, well, let's hope. All right, let's get our, our, um, our poor unfortunate ready for the demonstration. Oh, do come and watch. It'll be amazing. Come along. Okay. Where do you go? That, okay, that's not the electric chair. Said, come along and watch. Where is he? Showing something to my right. That's not it, is it? Oh. I do have to go turn that in at some point. Is it this? No, that's Henry Lemieux. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, I have to wait? Do that here? Didn't like that log. I want to sit in the mud. Okay, I can only do crafting here. I don't think it's safe to camp in the swamp. So I want to see the execution, and then I'm gonna go uh, go mow my lawn. Look like it's damn full with that thing out. Excuse me. You worry too much. Man's covered in filth. How's it going with Tells me I look like a fool. Do I need to go? Okay, speed limit's gone, so maybe here? This is the first time Arthur slept in like two weeks, so this is probably good for him. an exhibition. I don't care about that guy's art. I want to watch the electric chair. Where am I? This also isn't where I set up camp. Guy in Vietnam who hasn't slept since like 68. I feel like that's probably not true. I think 
think uh, I think if you pretty sure more than like ten days you die. But he's doing something that's close enough to sleep that it's it's sleep. Otherwise, scientists would be studying this man. Yeah, I guess I'll settle down one of these days. so very sure how I feel about progression. Paintings or otherwise. Come on. You won't have seen the like of it before. I promise. Maybe that's a good thing. Hold, hold on. Let me compose myself. This is fruity weirdo. Look at these idiots. Excuse me, Mr. Chatternay. Oh. Had you painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. Well, he's got hooves. About that. Clothes of civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <gasps> Well, that explains a decadence of I don't think Buddha said that. You got a picture of my wife here. In her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Why would you be showing it to that man? That's my mama. <gasps> as nude as the day she was born. Stop looking at my husband's buttocks. Mm -hmm. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. A nerve on you. That's it. <laughs> oh, come on, Mildred. This is no place for us. Come here, son of a bitch. You filthy little man. Oh. Oh. Come on, horse. We'll leave it. Hey, I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. Knock my head off. I'm fighting everyone now. I love art. I love art. This is my favorite art. Okay, where's my hat? This is the best art show ever. This guy knows how to put on an art show. This way, this way, come on. I think we are okay. The exhibition, what can you say? It was not bombing. Uh, I think if they're art. It was not. Girl. That was, that was a painting. It was a painting within a video game. Follow him there. Ah, uh, you're gonna get yourself shot, buddy. You did, and you are. Now maybe go be an asshole somewhere else for a while. I 
know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. Good luck. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Perhaps. Right now, it seems like the only thing it'll get me is kicking the balls. Oh, you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. My angel, my little bird! About to get shot by someone's husband. Okay, where's the execution? No execution. the right way to go. I, uh, there's no uh, there's no execution. That guy's a fraud. He doesn't even have an electric chair. So I'm gonna do the whole uh, like and subscribe and uh, do all that. Tell your friends and watch the streams. There's, uh, there's no one here. Streamlab says there's eight people here. YouTube says there's somewhere between zero and four. Uh, the execution's in the electric chair. It's a chair made of electricity. Chinese overlords, welcome to Chike It Up, the fastest growing YouTube channel that I have. What do I do on this channel? A lot of gaming, a lot of streaming, sometimes comedy videos, and every now and then I destroy a printer. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> I'm gonna get the serial numbers off of it. I'm gonna contact technical support, and we're gonna we're gonna get this working again. Yeah. Oh shit! There's billions of dollars in here. Billions of dollars lost. Snap it right back into place. All these little gears. Yeah, I think I'll get it replaced under warranty. I think it's still good. I think it's still a usable printer. <laughs> 